Every driver has a story to tell. Of their first race. Their first race car. Drivers will talk about their victories, their losses, and their journey. Here is the starting point for racing dreams, where aspiring drivers begin forging their own legacy. For a select devoted few, awaits not just the finish line, but the chance to become a racing legend. Welcome to Forza Motorsport. I'm here to help you achieve racing glory. Now this is where your journey starts. And trust me when I say it's gonna be a hard fought, hard driving road to win the cup. It'll be a road full of choices you'll have to make. And here's the first one. Who are you? What's going on ladies and gentlemen? It's Dan here and welcome to Forza Motorsport 7. We're kicking things off here. We've got to pick our character if we want to go male or female. Well, since we're doing this to the best of our ability to be a sim, we're going to do male. Unless I'm I forgot Time to tell you guys something. Your first driver gear. You come across more as you race. Okay, so we got the alpha gear which is default. The pro rata red, solids and stripes, not just for billi billiards anymore. Ha, <laughs> I like that. And then we also have the finish first red. Durable and practical. This driver's suit is ideal for a hot lap or an endurance run. The thing is, uh, these, I believe, uh, like the version of the game we have are the, um, the ultimate edition. The ultimate gold edition. So we're going to get all these DLCs and car packs and all that cool stuff, of course, as well. Right off the bat, though, I'm not really a fan of either of these, these two right here. I'm not a big fan. This one looks the best. But... I don't know. Hot lap or endurance run, it doesn't matter. Well, you know what? Let's let's just do let's do this one. Honestly, it, it's a decent Here, blend. You have a choice between starting your campaign for the Forza Drivers Cup, jumping into multiplayer to race against drivers from all over the world, or exploring at your own pace. All right. Well, we're gonna drive. We're gonna eventually do this. I just want to go to the main menu and set some stuff up. All right. So. Now I should have myself a selection Car of cars to choose from. It's a great way to have plenty of cars at your disposal. It's also a solid way to get better rewards. The more cars you get, the better your milestone rewards will be. Okay, every car has a score attached to it. And the more cars you collect, the higher your total car collection score. And that'll mean unlocking even more fantastic cars at higher tiers. I could have sworn I do have cars. It says I don't have any of them in here. Unlock with a collector. So these things are going to get better as we go along, obviously. Uh, my garage. I can't access this just yet. Specialty dealer. Um, what I think we should do, guys, is kind of kick things off with the Forza Drivers Cup. Let's kind of get this thing rolling. The Forza Drivers Cup, the world's largest, most diverse, sanctioned motorsport series. For decades, it's drawn the racing world's best. To win, it will take speed, versatility, and adaptability. Spanning five continents and the world's most legendary circuits, only a few will climb to the top, where racing immortality awaits the winner. But first, step into the shoes of past winners and learn what it takes to win driving's top prize. Speed. The defining element of racing. Speed is more than the miracles of engineering and design. It is drivers who embrace the pursuit of going ever faster. Last season's cup winner, Michael Mueller, is one of those drivers. Known for bringing record-breaking cars to the track, he turned heads at the Dubai Invitational when he drove a car no one knew existed. The Porsche GT2 RS. 
I did actually do this at... I played this with this car at E3 this year. Clear skies. 30... Oh, man, it's hot. And being in a race car, too, at those temperatures would be absolutely a torture. Here we go. We're jumping in. Introductory race and tutorial, so to speak. I'm not on the racer's line. I think it's got auto braking. I'll have to turn a lot of driver aids on because some of them are just really bad. Got a BMW i8 in front of me. Porsche, or sorry, uh, Aston Vantage. I'm assuming a Vantage S in front now. Oh, this thing handles really differently. Take him on the inside. Oh, a little bump. Oh, getting, getting wild here. Is that the DB? I think that was the DB11 I just overtook. Hard on brake. Feather and throttle. Man, these driver's aids are not... I got to turn them off. But we'll just, I don't think we can do a whole, oh god. Right now I'm not doing a whole, like it, I can't tell you what it feels like right now. It feels like the game does not want me to do what I want to do. Like it's actually helping me steer and everything. It's so brutally easy. Like I'm barely doing anything at this point. But don't worry, this is kind of like a warm up lap. So I'm gonna, like I said, I'll leave it for now. I feel like the quality of this could be a bit better too. Uh, going a bit wide. Okay, actually it's telling me to, so I'm going to modify my assist right now. Yeah, you uh, can use the assist here to tweak how your car handles. Oh, there's default. All right, and this is where we'll change some stuff. So, super easy. So there was, oh man, I don't even want to know what that's like. We'll start with medium, but the suggested line, I think I might go on the braking only. ABS, we'll leave it on for now. Steering is going to be normal. Traction, stability control, shifting, ugh, automatic for now. We'll leave all this for now. I say that sounds good. That's a good, like, kind of warm up. Look at that. The track is losing to the to the elements of the desert. Oh, a little drift coming in. Oh man, I dr I break. Oh, break, break. Ooh, I went mad wide. How many laps, I wonder? Is it just one lap? Usually it's just one lap. Yep. That could have been better. It must be said. Oh well, it's the introductory lap just to get a feel for the game. And all that good stuff. Versatility means becoming a master of any vehicle. To win the cup, drivers must be versatile because they will not win with just one car, no matter how much speed they apply. At Magello, Maria Rossi earned the series points lead and eventually the Forza Drivers' Cup itself by having the skill to drive something as unconventional as a racing truck to victory. That's cool. So we're taking in, we're jumping into a different track right away. That's the first time they've done this. And this is the truck racing. So you gonna let us hop in? Maria Rossi. Mercedes Benz. Here we go. 
Oh, we're in the cockpit. Here we go. We're fighting our way through the middle. I don't want to go too wide. Get ready to break. Sorry, homies. Oh, we're trying to push him out. I'm kind of being shoved out. Oh, I'm going wide. Break, break, break. There you go. I wonder if we're going to throw us in the GTR as well. Because those were the three major races you could choose from. The Porsche, the Merc truck, or the GTR. Oh, a bit wide. I'm going out. I don't know why the quality of the of the of, you know the graphics look so bad right now. I think the default ones are pretty bad. <laughs> don't worry, I'll adjust them so they look a little prettier. There you go hitting that apex. Don't need to really break because these things weigh so much. Oh my god, they're really just giving us a mulligan on this one. Heavy braking. Getting a bit squirrely under braking, full power. I didn't hit the line very well. I'm gonna, I'm gonna understeer a bit there. It's okay, I have room for error, clearly. There you go, full power through. These things actually handle relatively decent. It must be said. Feathering throttle. Ooh, I'm cutting. Oh man, break. Uh, see, that line was horrible, as you can see. Under steering all the way into the other side of the track. It's okay, Rossi's gonna get the win. Come on, baby. Yes! Sweet! So do we have another one? Do we have another GTR? Is that up next? Yes it is, definitely. It's in bad weather. Harsh weather. Adaptability. Only the prepared will be able to cope with any change on the track. Cup legend Yukio Takagi is renowned for remaining focused, even during a downpour. To win the Forza Drivers' Cup, drivers must adapt, because speed and versatility are nothing when no two laps are the same. Well, this should be interesting. Is it not the GTR? It is the GTR. Okay, that's what I thought. See an M3 GT. Ooh, lovely. Ukiyo Takagi. Takagi. T Takagi? Something of that nature. I've got to do a lap with him as well. Here we go, full power, baby. I'd say the game already looks better. I did modify, but it's like, can't do it right now. Oh my god. Nice and easy. The water is not a friendly surface. You can feel it trying to kick out a little bit. Look at that. Whoa, she's getting a bit squirrely. Okay, I got it. I still got it. Got a Bentley in my rear. Hang on, buddy. The four-wheel drive is gonna help us here immensely. Full power, hit that apex. Beautifully done. Oh, I'm going a bit wide. Still got it, we still got it. Holy hell, this game looks beautiful. I think the graphics definitely got adjusted. It must have set me on like medium settings. 
Which is just an... In oh, God. I'm wide. I'm in the... Oh, no. Cut him off. Cut him off like that. There you go. See that? Keep him in your rears. Hard on brakes. Hard on brakes. Got a little sharp left. Oh, man. I went really wide. Still got it, though. Oh, man. That... Oh, that did it. I had to manually set everything to ultra. I mean, when you have a t 1080 Ti, you have to have it on ultra. What is this, you know? Put me on, like, medium or something. Like it's 1995. Oh, my God. That... Oh, it looks so good, this game. Wow. Just the weather effects, too. Heavy brake. Back on the power. Clipping the apex. Let it run out. There you go. Heavy braking, heavy braking. I braked a little bit late. I braked late. E-brake. Oh, no. Don't, don't just goose it, because we'll spin. Oh, the Bentley caught up. Just keep it under control. This is the final stretch. Here we go. Ow! Yes, please. What's next for us then? Intro's done. We should. We now we're probably gonna have to pick a car. Here we go. These are the different. Now you've seen what it takes to win. Speed, versatility, and adaptability. Now, it's up to you. You're about to take part in the premier contest in all of racing. The Forza Drivers' Cup draws only the best. Yeah, it'll be a challenge. But when you lift that trophy, everyone will know you're the world's greatest driver. Okay, well, look at this, guys. Up first is the Seeker Welcome Championship. To the Seeker Championship. Now, each series is based on more than 50 car divisions, featuring different types of vehicles. So, it's time to make a choice. Which series will you choose first? So, here's what we can do. We, depending on how many races, I could put uh, the entire championship into one class one video or whatever or I could kind of I don't know I think I might do what I'm gonna do first is split the video here wait do I have any VIP rewards I do gear mods and special vehicles to add to your collection all right we got a few VIP crates for being a VIP club let's open this up what do we got hundred credits oh look at that VIP blue 14 what is that is that an M4? You're going fast. You're going through too fast. Collection scores. So it just says M4 Coupe Forza Edition, and then we have the '69 Camaro Super Sport Coupe uh, Forza Edition as well. We still have two more crates to go. That's sick, dude. Hundred thousand creds as well. VIP purple, white, '92 Ford Cos Cosworth, RS Cosworth. That's an amazing car. And then 2013 Ram Runner Forza. I don't know. If we do truck racing, that'll be handy. Uh, and one last VIP crate to go. What are we sitting with? We got a green. What does that mean? Oh, it's a common. So the, the gold are the legendaries. Whoa. VIP black. Look at that. Collection score. And a 2012 GTR black. All right, that's all we got, I think. Wait, what's this? Chance for a legendary car. Oh, you got to buy it. So I have 100,000 to kick things off. Um, you get mystery crates, basic crates, and things like that. AKA, ladies and gentlemen. Oh, look at that. Gave us an M4. It just threw us in the M4 right away. Driver gear. So now that I have them. Personalize what you wear when you hit the track. You'll unlock more driver gear. There's the Climb Kana. from prize crates. Ken Block recently had this. VIP purple. That's that's considered VIP white. 
That one's actually pretty sweet. I like that one. Although the black looks pretty solid. It's got a bit of gold in there as well. I think I like the black. Well, let me go to the driver's gear again. Ports of favorites, pop culture. Ah, look at this. Is, please tell me there's a stick option. Is there a stick option? It's the simplest. Look at this. That's so funny. Oh, classic racing. Suits, that's so cool. Wait, where was it? The high flyer. Hip hop. Uh, these are cool, man. Like, they're... I never would have suspected something like Spa Day. That's so funny. There's a lot of suits you can get. Team colors. Gotcha. A Barth. So you can get car styles. Where's the BM? Got Audi here. Team colors. Hold on. Where's BMW? Where is it, homie? There's Bugatti. Should be up then. Do they not have a BMW team? Apparently they don't. Team, I, that's interesting. Oh, you know what? It's probably an M then. I would imagine it's M. H-I-J-K, I'll guarantee you, because it's going to be M colors, right? Apparently not. Mercedes-Benz? But they don't have... That's actually quite a surprise. Bowler for like the wildcat. Racing colors. Or racetracks, and then you got the country flags. There's there's mine, baby. But it's it's an uncommon. So you gotta unlock these things though, guys. You gotta unlock them. Wow, there's some pretty insane ones, aren't there? Message center, what do we have? DLC, no messages, because this game isn't even out yet, guys. Obviously. So, if we go into the drive... Okay, actually, let's go to the cars. Let's look at my garage. This is what we've got. we got the M4, Forza Edition. It's a legendary. What do we got here? Well, you, if you use it, 40% credits plus 10,000 credits at the Nürburgring. Hold on a minute. Chev. What do we get here? 30% credits, 7,500 at 150 mile an hour. The Escort Cosworth. The RS Cosworth. Look at that, it's like super rallied up. That's sick. 5,000 5, XP at night for that one. The GTR Black. So 50,000 credits plus 10,000 credits at Suzuka. And then the Ram. 30% credits, 7,500 XP at Test Track Airfield. And these are all legendaries. So you might, you guys might not get the same thing I do. But here's the thing. Let me go to, uh, the, let's see if we go buy a car. I want to see something. I have 100,000. The Fast and the Furious. You know why I, it's free? Because of my my history with uh, Forza, Forza games. Forza Horizon. I can get all these because I have the Fast and Furious DLC. See? Look at that. Rare. These are completely free. Oh, this is the Hoonigan pack as well. You got to remember that. Oh my god, that just looks like something out of <laughs> old school The Fast and Furious. RWB, Porsche 911. It's part of the Hoonigan pack, you can see that. The Escort RS 1800, Hoonigan version, so Ken Blocks. These are all like Ken Blocks cars. A part of that pack. The Hoonicorn Mustang. That's four drive. These things are all Class D. That, oh, that's a Hoonigan? I thought that'd be Fast and Furious. This is. The F-Type R. Oh, right, right, right. The local motors. AMG GTS. Some nice cars. Plymouth GTX. Subaru STI. We got quite a selection of free cars. But I want to see something. Did I go too far? A, B. So why is there... I probably just, I probably just can't, well no, this is the EB110, that's an S-Class vehicle, here's BM, that's weird, okay, I can't buy any of these, the M2, I8, this is an A, I'm, I'm actually kind of surprised at that, I'm curious to see if they have my car, like, the car I, I actually own, they have to, well, here's what my car is based, here it is, there's my baby, hey girl, how you doing? How much is this? I can't buy it yet. 
But I will be buying it, let me tell you that. It's the same year and everything, 08 BMW M3. And then I'll be like, hopefully it'll let me pick my color. You get your hands on these cars, collection tier. You'll need to increase your collect so what, what, what tier is this? This is tier 2, so I can buy it once I hit tier 2. So that's kind of what we're sitting off. All right, ladies and gentlemen, so I basically got my basis started here. I've got some cars that I've unlocked. Uh, we've done the intro races to get a feel for things. And now we're basically going to be starting the actual Forza Drivers Cup and the Secret Championship, which is the very, very first championship. And I'm very excited, actually, to get into this. This game looks a hell of a lot better than any of the other Forzas I played. It looks like it's way more involved. Oh, my God, look at that M4. It looks so good like that. Wide body. Got a lot of arrow on it. Just track ready. It's Liberty Walk version. Normally, I'm not a big fan of Liberty Walk because they kind of... Well, everything's kind of bolt-on, but it really looks good on this car, doesn't it? Mmm. Very good. Very tasty. Yes, I said it. It's tasty. Anyway, ladies and gentlemen. So I want to thank you guys for watching this very first video. If you enjoyed it, do me a favor. Hit that like button. Let me know in the comments below what you think. And you got to tell me, is this a series you want me to pump out with ferocity? Please let me know. This is a nice... That's what the comments were for. And the like button as well. If you slap that like button, I know you guys want me to, want me to pump this out. Also, be sure to like and follow my pages on social media. Those will be down below in the description and I'll play at the end card of this video. If you're interested, you want to get yourself a shirt or a hoodie, there's a link to my Spreadshirt shop in the description as well. Thank you guys so much again. Take it easy. Have a fantastic day. I'll be seeing you soon for more content. But until then, let's hand things over to Knox Hill. Have a good one, guys. Who's the man with the plan? Hmm. If you feel trouble, wild and wild, don't need violin and hit you. 8,000. Wait a minute, hold that style. It's style Dan. Goddamn, Billy Jack. We still riding tires flat. I hear them sirens, sea shots flying. So we driving fire back. If they ain't vibing, lie with that. Got me dressed up in all black. What up? Hood up, and I see them haters. Try to run with us, they gon' need inhalers. Gotta breathe them hard just like the beta players. Grab your respirators. Night invaders get like sabered. Mass on for the shooters. Move like trash. The bed intruder got that Glock and got them woofers. Just press play, I'll keep it moving. Who is Knox? Still, you damn fools. Keep it fresh like canned food. There ain't nothing we can't do, so tune into that damn kill. Yeah. It was never, ever a game.